I have a product, I think I'm going to call it a rave, I really like this guy. It's the uh, Oskia Micro Exfoliating Balm, Nutra Active Brightening and Refining Exfoliant. I got this in my first cult beauty box from Caroline Hirons, and I had had it in a, like a drawer somewhere and I hadn't used it. And then when she announced her most recent box this was in it, I was like, huh. Maybe I should go try that out. Uh, retails for £48 on um, cultbeauty.com. That's where I would get mine. It's just easy with free worldwide shipping, right? Um, and basically what it is, it's an exfoliating balm. So it comes in this glass packaging and you get how much product? 1.7 ounces of product. Um, and then it comes like so. It's a white balm. And when you you know, take it off your finger, it looks like that, and then you rub it in, you don't see the granulars, but as soon as you start rubbing, you can feel them. Exfoliate my hand as I talk to you. Um, it has an interesting, very like spa smell, like it's kind of relaxing the minute you put it on, it's strange, um, but I like that. A lot of luxury products, I feel like part of what you're paying for is a spa experience, right? Because as you're doing your skincare, you're getting some of that self-care, that self-love, and so you want, you want the sensorial experience to be good. So that's the first selling point, I think, on this guy. So what happens basically, it's an exfoliator, right? So it's, it's a physical exfoliator. And the more water you add to it, the less potent it becomes. So for me, as I keep using it, all I keep thinking of, it's like Exfolicate, but customizable. So Exfolicate by Kat, Kat, Kate Somerville is one of my favorite uh, like exfoliating gels, creams, you know, <laughs> what have you. Um, I really enjoy it. And uh, the problem is though, I find that it can be quite potent. This one, the more water you add to it, the less harsh it becomes. If you need a good exfoliation, so I needed a nice, really good exfoliation last night, and I used it straight on, and by kind of 45 seconds in, my skin started feeling t like almost numb between the friction it was getting from, you know, me rubbing it and what have you, which was good, because I felt like I was getting in there for a deep exfoliation. On days where my skin is more sensitive, I can add more water, it turns into more of a milk, um, and then it's not as harsh, which I think is nice at a product of this type and at this price point, it's nice that there's customizable ways to use it. Um, what I find that it does is it just really sort of um, clears away any dead skin cells and so um, if I have old acne scarring or just dull skin or dehydrated skin, um, I'm able to clear everything away. My face just looks clear and happy. I mean, I had a breakout and it's still there this morning because it's not going to clean your breakout, um, but it just makes that whole area around it just so nice and calm and happy. Um, I have skin that's super t um, like sensitive and anything too harsh or abrasive is too much for it and it works really well for me. Um, and I think again, because of the customizable ways to use it, it can work well for a variety of people. So um, a big thumbs up on this and I highly recommend it. I know it's expensive, but a little bit goes a long way and you're not gonna use it more than two max three times a week. So you'll have a lot of it to go around. Um, but yeah, any questions, comments, your experiences with it, leave those for us down below and we'll go from there. My first, uh, let's do some points of positivity. My first point of positivity is makeup that's making me happy. I keep like sneaking looks at myself in the viewfinder um, and I'm trying to focus on you guys, but I have really been enjoying it. The second is a really uh, great brew of peach iced tea that I made last night, which uh, kept me nice and hydrated into the evening, which made me happy. And then my third point of positivity is getting to sleep in a couple extra hours this morning. I decided to go for a run instead of going to the gym, so I got to sleep in a little bit, which was nice. Um, that is it for me today. As always, please let me know it's making you guys smile. I will talk to you soon, but before I leave you, as always, let me remind you that life is just way too short to wear boring lipstick. Bye, guys.